Alright, well good morning. My name is William Lee and today we're at uh, Priest Lake Golf Course in Priest Lake, Idaho. Um, we're on number one and the point of these videos is just kind of to show you the courses and not how to golf or teach you how to golf. It's more of a, of a scenic view of, of where the places we get to go. Uh, we use our gift of golf carts which we got at the Spokane Golf Show. Uh, I think that was back in March. Today is May 19th. This course opened on the 17th, two days ago on Friday. Today is Sunday. Um, so anyway, we're just going to go through the course and show you uh, what the Priest Lake Golf Course has to offer hole by hole. A relaxed day. Now, do you want something to drink? No, why is there so many Okay, so hole number one kind of veers off to the right. Um, there's my, my wife's sis teeing off. The bunkers there, you kind of want to aim from there from the whites. kind of gives you a direct shot to go right to the, to the green. So your best hit off number one is to aim for the sand bunkers there. A little off to the right of it. Right by those two tall trees, uh, there's another sand trap on the other side of it, which is just impossible to get off. Um, this dog lays off to the right, so a good, clean, middle fairway shot should be your best bet. Okay, we're on the second hole here at Priest Lake. Uh, this one's pretty straightforward. What you got to watch out for is the hazard up front. So if you can really kill the drive, you're going to want to club back a little bit. Um, right about here is where I'm aiming for. So here we go on hole number two. <laughs> so here's the water hazard in front of hole two. It's, uh, it's a pretty good pond. you gotta, you got to make it. <laughs> You got to fly that water and land on the green. Whoa, whoa. Looks so pretty that there's so many balls in the So one thing cool about Priest Lake is all the wildlife you get to see. Here's a little baby turtle we just found. Go ahead and put your ball next to it, Leah, so people can see how big it is. It's tiny. We're going to move him over so he doesn't get stepped on. He's kind of hard to see. So, Lee, you want to pick him up and stick him over there towards the towards, towards the water's edge. Okay, honey? Here, honey. Oh, yes, Teddy, close. Yeah, put him over here. Because... Okay, hole number three here from the white tee box. So, what we got to do is you got to go. This thing really veers over to the right, turns the corner. So, if you got a good slice and you get up past those trees there, then you got it made. If not, you kind of want to maybe uh, hit a little short and for that lone pine sitting out there. You can see the 150 marker in the middle of the fairway. It's a nice hole. This course is in really good shape today. So another thing, cool thing about Priest Lake here is your yardage markers are birdhouses on the side of the fairway. Of course you have one in the middle. There you go, that little stick there. But that white, there's your 150. There's a red down there that's your 100 marker i think it's kind of cool to make birdhouses okay here we are on hole number four this is a par five it's pretty straight shot but as you can see there's a lot of water hazards you have to carry in order to get to the fairway from the white tees so our flag is down there by the beautiful house at the end of the end of the link and um i'm gonna aim for those geeks see how i do all right, here we are on hole number five. This is a par three elevated tee box. See the green down there. You got water right behind it. Um, this is just a really good view. Oh, my granddaughter, Leah, she wants to be in every shot. So we'll see if we can make that happen. Um, just a beautiful view of the course and just uh, it's a beautiful day What's and with beautiful one? people and we're having a really good time. What is that? So here we are, hole number six. This one goes way off to the right. So if you look down the fairway there, you see that big tree? If you can thread the needle and get it right in between there with a good, well with the slice, you're closer to the pin. Safest bet, safest bet, is to stay on the left hand side and just kind of line up to the 150 marker there. Um, and once again, the course is in great shape. We're having a really fun day and uh, it's really nice out. Here's a shot of the sixth green. Uh, sand bunkers on either side. The greens are in really good shape. A little slow, not really, really fast, um, but still really good shape. Okay, we're at hole number seven. Uh, a lot of water to carry, so you want to make sure you get over that or you're going to be using a new ball. And it's got a 
we'll look over here. So here we are at the White Tees. It's kind of a valley. We've got to go hit, carry the water. And then our green is elevated up on the other side of the valley there. So, uh, yeah, it's just kind of a layup shot and then chip to the green. What's really great about this, it takes you right back to the clubhouse. Some courses don't do that. You gotta bring your own lunch. Um, so again, this is a it's par four, got a pretty straight fairway. We do turn a little bit for rock pile here. I'll show you in a minute. Some trees in the way, so oh man, it's a left hand yeah, left hand turn. So I would it's gonna hit it probably with my three wood, try to get the 150 mark, middle fairway, and, and aim for the green from there. Kinda of hard. So looking straight out, yeah, there's our rock pile, the sand bunker in front of it, and there's some trouble trees that try to avoid just get straight in the fairway. So another thing uh, Priest Lake Golf Course has to offer is they have a driving range. So you can get here and warm up, hit a couple balls, and you know, get it going. There's a putting green over by the clubhouse. I uh, got a shot of that earlier, and we'll hit that on the turn. Okay, here we are on the backside hitting hole number 10. Um, this has two carries, actually. There's kind of a swamp right here landing area and then we're going to make the left hand turn and this is all just kind of a marshy grass so it's about two good chip shots and you're on the green so we'll look on down the fairway here you want to avoid the big rock that's never good and then just past that you can see the marsh so fairway on the other side that's your landing spot it's gonna be hard to make sure you don't get in the water Nice hit. Perfect. Right at the red pen. <laughs> Good job. Okay, so here's the second part of hole 10. We came off our tee box, and now we're making a really tight left-hand turn. You can see the flag way back there, just past the marsh. It's going to kind of be hard. So you got to carry, you're not going to make it. Okay, hole number 11. It's a par 3. Again, another carry, and it's it's marshy swamp land, so you're not getting your ball back. Um, right over here, as long as we can carry that, it's not too far, hit the fairway, and the flag's right there. Got a bunker off to the left, or off to the right there. Okay, here we are in hole number 12. Um, this one's long, it's a little hard. It's got a lot of garbage here on the right hand side, so if you got a slice, again, it's, it's, it's going in the woods. Um, fun hole this is a good one so anyway let's take a look on down a couple houses right there in front of us we should get a nice good clean drive kind of right over this uh right hand side aiming for the red bird box way up there you should be right on target for the green <laughs> almost <laughs> Okay, so here we are on the 13th, it's par four. You just saw the drive up into this. This is probably one of my favorite cor or holes on this course. It's just, you're in the woods. You're, you're out here and this is it's just beautiful. So again, here we're at White Tea Box. We're gonna carry over some water, a little bit of marshland, and then we hit the fairway. So we take a look down and you just see it's, it's beautiful. I mean, this is just, this is, uh, 
my favorite spot. Okay, here we are. We're a hole number 14, and this is a par 5. Uh, what's really cool about this one is up on the left-hand side, just around the corner, and we'll shoot some video when we get over there, it's a big old granite wall. It's just kind of, it's kind of impressive. So what you want to do here, well, there's a lone pine right in the middle, and that, uh, I've hit that a couple times. So your best bet is getting between the bank and the tree. Just kind of go straight forward to that, that rock way back over there, and you should be pretty good, pretty lined up for the, for the green. Okay, we're on 15 now. It's another par three uh, here at the White Tees. Got a lot of carry with a small green. Go ahead and turn around and take a look. Uh, once again, it's all marshy, so Not to get your ball aim for the center and try to two put that thing in there. If you don't Yeah, you made it. <laughs> nice Yay. shot. Yay! <laughs> All right, we're on 17 now. This is a par three. There's Most no of this travels uphill. Um, what you got is a nice big backstop of rocks up there. So we'll just take a look real quick. It's pretty straight. It's got a hazard on your left with some sand. But not too but bad. But there's not any water. No anything. water on this nope. one. No. Nope. Okay, here we are, number 18. This is the last hole. It's a par five. Uh, this one's pretty straightforward. Again, just bring out the big boy and let her rip. As you can see, looking out towards the fairway, it's just got a bunch of little knolls and stuff there, but you can get up over the first hump there, you can get a speed slot, and then right onto the green. Get it, Leah. All right, good hit. All right, so there we go. There's uh, 18 holes in Priest Lake Golf Course. So again, this video wasn't to give instruction or anything like that. It's just to show people the beautiful courses we have up here and um, just to share them with you. Uh, this is one of my favorite spots. Really like it on the back night. You really feel like you're out in the woods. Just, uh, just a beautiful spot. We had a really good day. Some great people. Um, you know, it's not that I love playing golf. I love the places I get to go and the people I play with. Bye.